Today we'll see one of the crazy requirements that is Big Boss Reality Show using PLS scheme. In this video, we'll cover three requirements that is to display a list of nominated candidate contestant for the particular week and to capture the votes polled by the audience and to display top three contestants based on the votes. So in this video, I have taken Telugu Big Boss season five and week 14 as an example. So once we'll get the nominated contestants, we need to vote for them. So if you want to solve this requirement, you should have better understanding of the following concept, the data types, order by class for sorting purpose, DDL, DDL for creation of table, DML to insert data and TCL for transaction control, that is for commit or rollback. And you should know what is a processor, how to write a processor and how to execute a processor, what is in and out parameter and what is anonymous block, sysref cursor, cursor attributes, 12C feature will make use of it and looping concept and regular expression and DBMS output to see the result on the console. Let us discuss one by one. In this slide, we'll cover what is how to write a processor and what are the data types. Create or replace processor, processor name. These are the local variables, L contestant name, L number of words and L date of words. Where care, number and date, or these are the data types. So your DVMS output dot put line is used to display, is used to see the result on the console. Now this is a sample processor. So if you want to execute any processor by using anonymous block, we can able to execute begin and the processor name we need to write and end. So output would be the contestant name Sunny. Next to the regular expression, we'll use regular expression substring. So if you want to extract like uh, any part of the string, we'll make use of regular expression substring. So what I need to get, we need, I need to get only sunny. That is up to underscore where I need to get. So for this, what I need to do, right? One comma one, I need to write. So if you want to extract nine, what I need to do, I need to do one comma two. Hope this is clear like if you want to the particular string up to underscore we'll make use of one comma so if you want to get the part after underscore we need to get we need to use one comma two next to the sysref cursor this is a system defined ref cursor it's a weak ref cursor it's a pointer to the query results entire result will be stored in the particular cursor variable sysref cursor variable the syntax would be like this variable name and the sysref cursor by using a simple example, we can able to understand this concept. Create a replace processor employed by department. Here department is the input parameter and the result will be stored in sysref cursor. Our requirement is that all the employees, all the employee number and employee names for the particular department should be displayed by using sysref cursor. So based on the particular department passed by there, we need to display the list of employee number and employee name. That entire result will be stored in P result. That is the sysref cursor variable. So if you want to see the result, what we need to do we, by using anonymous block, we'll make use of it. So employee by department number is department is the parts is the processor name 200 is the department input parameter and result is the output sysref cursor variable. So loop why we use loop here we, uh, they, because there will be multiple records that's why we'll make use of looping. So fetch result into L employee number and L employee name. DBMS output is used to see the uh, result on the console. So what happen if you do like loop, fetch, dbms and loop. So it will iterate n number of times. So we need to put some conditions so that it will stop like by using exit when result percentage is not found. This is the cursor attribute here. So the purpose of this uh, result percentage not found is that whenever like whenever the cursor doesn't find any data, it will come out of that particular loop and close the result like close the cursor. Hope sysref cursor concept is clear. Uh, we'll start the actual requirement. The first requirement is that to display a list of nominated can nominated contestants for the particular week. So as mentioned earlier, I have taken Telugu Big Boss season five and fourteenth week as the nomination. 
so for this purpose what first we need to is that big boss table we need to create in this big boss table what I have taken the columns of language like whether it is a telugu hindi or tamil big boss or uh, like season like number 1 season 1 season 2 like this and also the contestant id contestant name and also week which week we need to do like eliminated and also like uh, i have taken two more column that is eliminated and nominated like whether he said whether the contestant is eliminated or whether the contestant is nominated for the particular week so by using dml statement by using dml statement like insert statement i have created some dummy data in it so if you want to like if you want to control this transaction the dml transaction i will make use of tcl the transaction control language that is commit a complete video is, has been made on the particular like uh, sql statements i have provided that uh, url that uh, youtube link in that in the comment section so this is the sample big boss data, big boss table select star from big boss will get the language the telugu language season 5 the contestant id contestant name and a particular week whether the contestant has been eliminated or nominated if you see here the first requirement is that we need to display list of nominated for the 14 week that means we'll get four records that is sunny causal stira and shanmu so one more condition we need to put whether the contestant has been eliminated or not if it is eliminated he can't be in the nominated candidate so like this big boss telugu 5 14 week nomination list we need to display the first requirement is that list of nominated contestant for this i have created one processor the name of the processor is bb nominated contestant these are the parameters and the parameters that language which language the season what is the season what is the week and the result will be stored in the sysref cursor so language is telugu season is Fifth season and week is fourteen. So for this, what I am doing, I am taking sysref cursor variable that is p result contestant id contestant name and have put one alias name nominated contestants. So these are the parameters like p language, p season, and p week. So p language will be Telugu, p season will be. 5 and p week will be 14 and what we need to check and eliminated it should be n and nominated should be y so it will display the nominated nominated contestants so if you want to see the result what we need to use by using anonymous block will make will see the result so these are the local variables result l contestant id l contestant name bp nominated contestants is the procedure name so these are the parameters we need to pass to the particular processor language telugu season 5 week and the result will be stored in result the result is the sysref cursor the purpose of loop is that there are multiple records are there but that's why we are using loop loop fetch result into l contestant id and l contestant ID. these are the two local variables exit this uh, is already mentioned that uh, like if the cursor doesn't have any data we need to come out of that particular loop for uh, to see the result on the console we make use of dbms output so contestant id contestant name so end loop close result so cursor will be closed so we'll get the exact output this is the output like contestant id these are the five contestants which have been nominated for the particular week the second requirement is to capture the votes polled by the audience that is the audience will poll like uh, they will they will put votes to the favorite contestant those uh, those votes should be captured like this so i have polled nine votes like it will display the nominated contestant the audience will poll their votes to the favorite contestant like i have polled nine votes to sunny and one vote to to manas so there will be 10 votes for the particular day so these votes should be captured in our database so for this purpose what i have created i have created one ddl statement that is create statement that is the name of the table is big boss weekly votes in this table i will capture all the votes polled by the particular uh, contestants by the audience so like the language season week which week they uh, which week and the contestant and number of votes polled the particular contestant and audience like who has polled the who has polled the votes and which on which date 
it has date and on date of votes is nothing but on which day the user the audience has polled the votes so for this i have created one procedure that is bb votes capture the name the, the name itself specify that this procedure is to capture the votes polled by the audience the uh, parameters for it's like the language the season week sunny manas like these are the contestant names the sun the list of contestants nominated for the particular week i will explain one more time the language that would be telugu the season will be 5 week will be 14 the p sunny and monas tiram shenmuk siri are the list of nominated candidate, candidates and the p audience like the audience name and result the entire result will be like we need to show to the user that whether the whether it has successfully polled or not so i created one insert statement for sunny so insert into big boss weekly words is a table name these are the column names so p language is the p language is the parameter p season p week is the parameter and p audience here what here how the uh, parameter will come like sunny underscore number of words pulled by it In a similar way, I have written for manas like one more insert statement: p language, p season, p week, and uh, p sunny, p, p manas, and p audience. And this is state is true. The day is the current date. Similar way, it will be first year. I'm also same. So first year, I'm and Shanmu, and first year. So there are five insert statements. After that, we need to control like we need to we need to store the data permanently by using commit. We can able to store. So once everything done, we need to display to the user like votes have been successfully captured. Thank you for voting. So we need to display to the user after commit like we need to display like votes has been successfully captured. Thank you for voting. So by using anonymous block, we can able to see the result. So language BB words capture is the procedure name. Language Telugu season five week fourteen. Sunny underscore nine. What is means like Sunny the name of the con name of the nominated contestant and how many words have been polled. Nine words have been polled. So name of the contestant minus and one word. Sri Ram zero words. Shanmuk zero words. Siri zero words. So who has contested like my name like audience name Ravi. p result so result will be where care so if you want to see the result by using dbms output we can able to see the result so output would be words have been successfully captured thank you for voting next requirement is that to display top three contestants based on the votes for this i have created one more process that is bb top three contestants it has three input parameters and one output parameter the input parameter is the language Season and week. So particular week, we need to display top three contestants. Output would be sister of cursor. So by using an uh, aggregate functions and group by, we can able to achieve this one. So P language, P season, P week is the parameters passed by the user. So group by contestant, order by number of votes descending. Number of votes descending is the descending order will display them. And I'm making use of two LC feature. If you see here, fetch first three rows only. So it will fetch three rows only. This is the two LC feature. So a complete video made on two LC feature. I will provide in the description link. Please go through it. So one more time, I'll explain by using aggregate function sum of number of votes and by using group by and by using two LC feature, we can able to achieve this requirement. So, if you want to see the result by using anonymous block, we can able to achieve. So, L contestant L words are the local variables. This is the procedure: BB top three contestants, P language Telugu, season five, week fourteen, P result. So, result will be sister of cursor. So, loop purpose is that if we have more number of records, no, so that's why we are using looping concept. So, if you want to see the result by using DBMS underscore output dot put line, so end loop, close cursor. So, this is the this is the way if you want to see the result by using anonymous block, 
we can able to assume. So output would be. So it will display top three contestants. If you like the content, subscribe and share the channel. Thank you for watching.